Hello and welcome to yoga. Let's get started. Work your way towards the back of your mat. Open your knees out wide. Bring your toes in. Rest your forehead. Bring your elbows through your fingertips down to connect to your mat. Begin to relax and lengthen your inhales and exhales. Breathing in and out, nice and slow and controlled. Scan your body from your fingertips, up your forearms, down into your biceps and shoulders, your head through your torso, hips down into your knees and knees down into your toes. Soften your muscles. Breathe life and air into your body. Feel the inhales enter your lungs, your rib cage, your belly expand and fill up. And then feel the exhales exit, either your nose or your mouth. Ujjayi breath is always a great option to build heat in your body, breathing in and out through your nose, trapping that heat in. Child's pose is always here for you, should you need a break or you need to ground down through your practice. Inhale, tabletop. Release your face and your forehead away from your mat. Shift your shoulders forward, adjust your hands and your arms and your shins. Stack and align hips over knees and shoulders over wrists. Push down through your fingertips, rotate your elbows in a little bit, squeeze at your pelvic floor, and keep your spine nice and straight as you look down. Inhale, cow pose. Gently press your rib cage down, pull your elbows towards your torso, lift your gaze, pulling your chin away from your throat. Exhale, calf, round your spine and shoulders. Tuck your chin into your throat, squeeze your belly in even tighter. Inhale, cow pose. Exhale, calf pose. Inhale, cow pose. Exhale, calf pose. Good. Inhale, tabletop, tuck your toes under, exhale, downward facing dog. Push through the tops of your feet, through the tips of your toes. Be sure your feet are hip width distance. Keep a slight micro bend to your knees and keep your hips and knees aligned with your ankles. Press your chest towards your toes, feel your head melting towards your mat. Pedal your dog out and one knee at a time. As you bend one knee, opposite heel presses closer to your mat, stretching from the Achilles up into your calf and into your hamstring. Keep your neck relaxed, your shoulders soft, your belly tight. Steady both legs. Take a walk with your hands and arms. Back towards your feet. Toe heel your feet out to the distance of your mat for rag ball to the back of your mat. As you fold in half, grab opposite elbows. Relax, shake out your head. Sway forward and back a little bit. Allow your biceps and forearms to move freely. If you'd like to shift from leg to leg, sway side to side a bit. Come back through center 
release your hands to your mat, straighten both elbows, shift your left hand directly underneath your face so it's at the center of your mat. Inhale, ragdoll twist, extend your right arm up to the ceiling, bend your left knee and keep your right leg straight. Thoracic, thoracic spine twist as you reach up, stretching that right side. And then option to look up, bringing your chin a little bit closer to your shoulder. Keep breathing. One more inhale. Exhale, release into your forward fold ragdoll. Inhale, ragdoll twist. Take your right hand directly underneath your face to the center of your mat. Breathe as you lift your left arm up. And so your arms are in one line. Bend your right knee, straighten your left leg. Look up, optional, or directly to the side. As you twist and breathe into that left side thoracic spine twist. One more inhale. Exhale, forward fold. And then take a walk back. Meet in high plank pose with a nice long, long crown of head through the heels. Adjust your feet, hip width distance. Press your heels back. Bring your shoulders just over your wrist. So that nice long line of energy from crown through the heels. Lift up through the pelvic floor, keep your belly tight. Squeeze in tight and hold. Good, one more deep breath in. Exhale, downward facing dog. And look forward and forward fold as you step or hop through. Adjust your feet so they're either touching or hip width distance apart. With your forward fold, let's go ahead and fold at the waistline. Hands can release to your mat or you can take your hands behind your legs. Soft micro bend in your knees if you're feeling any tightness from the hamstrings up into just behind that uh, knee, the knee crease and into your calf muscles. Inhale, halfway lift spine. Make an L shape with your body, pulling away from your legs, kind of the head forward, glutes back. Option to just lightly graze your shin bones with your fingertips or let your arms hang, or you can push into your quads. One more inhale, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, mountain pose, Tadasana. Stand up nice and tall, stand your arms up to the ceiling, root down through all four corners of your feet, find that nice solid foundation, rotate the wrist back, ignite your tricep muscles, full inhale. Exhale, back bend, squeeze your glutes to protect your lower spine so you can get a bigger range of motion with the bend of your elbows, lift out of your heart. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, standing forward, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high plank, we were here before. I'm staying in high plank today. Option to shift forward. Option for high to low plank, Chaturanga, bend at your elbows, hug your biceps into your side body, lower no more than halfway down unless you're coming down to your knees. Inhale, high cobra or upward facing dog, straighten your elbows, send your heart forward. Exhale, downward facing dog. Let's flow, inhale, look forward. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, standing back bend. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high plank or chaturanga through to up dog or high cobra and back to down dog. One last time, inhale, look forward. Exhale, forward fold. 
Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, back bend. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high to low plank, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, standing forward fold. Inhale, chair fold, Utkatasana, bend your knees, stretch your arms, lengthen, drop glutes towards heels, look forward, soften your shoulders, shift the weight into your heels just a bit, hold, breathe in, exhale, hands to heart center, let's sit a little bit deeper, take a spinal twist to the right, left elbow just outside the top of the right quad, keep your hips and knees in one line. Your elbows in one line. Just like that ragdoll, option to lift your chin, option to look straight ahead. Keep breathing. Right, inhale, chair pose. Exhale, chair twist, hands to heart center. Twist to the opposite side, right elbow just outside your left quad, hips in one line, knees in one line. An option to look up or look directly to the left. Stay calm. And notice the pace of your breath. You're noticing that your breath is speeding up. Just slow it down to that four to six count count. Inhale, chair. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, high to low plank. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, three-legged down dog. Right leg up. Keep leaning with your heel. Exhale, low lunge. Step your right foot inside your right leg. Inhale, warrior two. Spin open your back leg. Extend your arms out to a T. Settle into your warrior two. Track your knee directly over the center of your foot. And then work on your depth. Work on the extension through your fingertips. Look forward as you settle in. Deep inhale. Deep exhale. One more inhale, flip your palm, stretch forward. Exhale, extended side angle. Land your elbow inside your bent knee, just at the center of your thigh and extend the opposite arm up. And keep twisting, keep working the side body. Inhale, reverse triangle, soften your front knee, reach back. Stretch back, lift out of your hip. Exhale, high to low plank. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Right, breathe in and breathe out. Inhale, three-legged down dog, left leg lead with your heel. Exhale, low lunge, step your left foot inside your left hand. Find your lunge, then open your back leg. Find your warrior two as you inhale. Keep breathing as you settle in. Now check in with the knife edge of your back foot. Be sure it's sealed. And your front knee tracks directly over the center of your foot. Keep looking forward as you settle in and relaxing into your warrior two. And one more inhale, flip your palms, reach forward. Exhale, extended side angle, tick tock your arms. And land just below the elbow inside the inner thigh. You can use pressure at the inner thigh as you extend and stretch. Mid spine twist. 
Again, notice your heart rate and your breath. As the heart rate increases, we slow the breath. Calm. Easy. Inhale, reverse triangle. Bring your front knee straight, stretch back with your front arm back hand to thigh. One more breath in. Exhale, high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Flowing through, sun B. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, chair twist. Hands to heart center, twist to the right. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, chair twist. Hands to heart, twist to the left. Inhale, chair. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, three-legged right leg. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, reverse triangle. Exhale, high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, three-legged left leg. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, reverse triangle. Exhale, high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. One more time. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose. Exhale, chair twist. Inhale, chair. Exhale, chair twist. Inhale, chair. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, three-legged right leg. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, extended. Inhale, reverse triangle. Exhale, high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, three-legged left leg. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, extend it. Inhale, reverse triangle. Exhale, high to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Come on down to your knees. Have a seat directly in the center of your mat. Moving into core. Slowly release your spine. Lay down nice and controlled. Bring the soles of your feet together. Stretch out your inner thighs a bit. Feel the release of your hips. And bring your fingertips behind your ears. Extend your elbows nice and wide, starting with Supta Baddha Konasana crunches, lifting up through the diaphragm area. Deep inhale. Exhale, lift, lift, lift. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Good, squeeze and hold and lower. Hover the top of the shoulders, lift up and down. Squeeze up and down. Keep space between your chin and your throat. Allow your airways to stay open. Good. 
good. Exhale. Exhale. Awesome. Good for four, three, two, and one. Nice work. Bring your arms behind you, your inner thighs in. We'll bring your legs to a reverse tabletop. Knees over hips, no space between your lower back and your mat. So by squeezing your pelvic floor and engaging those muscles, we're creating a seal between the spine and your mat. Take it into just a tabletop crunch. Lift, inhale, exhale, twist, left elbow, right knee. Keep your knees and thighs where they are. Inhale, center. Exhale, twist, then elbow comes over, thoracic spine twist. Good, exhale, back to center, inhale. Exhale, back to center. Nice job. So let's go for four. Three. Two. One more on the right. Finish up strong on the left. Nice work. Arms overhead. This time straighten your legs. Take a wall to wall. And let's bend the knees. Bring your index fingers and your thumbs to meet, creating a triangle. Let's go ahead and lift up. And then that same shape from the index fingers to the thumbs. Let's release the lower back. Soften your shoulders, pull your shoulders apart. Tuck your tailbone under. Straighten both legs, point your toes. I'm going to take a stationary hold to start. You can stay right here and you can begin to scissor kick the legs for lower belly activation. If you'd like, you can release your shoulders from your mat. Just right over left, left over right. Let's go, keep working. You got it. Nice job. So let's go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Oh, good job. Release your heels, bend your knees. You can lift, release your hands. Nice work. Very nicely done. Hug knees into chest. Grab a hold of your hamstrings. Take a few seated cat cows to stretch the belly. Kick your legs behind you. Downward facing dog. Inhale, hinge forward to high plank. Your exhale, release all the way down to your mat. Bring your arms out to a T. Inhale, locus. Squeeze your back muscles together. Elevate your legs, elevate your arms. Kiss your upper shoulder blades and point your toes, squeeze your glutes, breathe in. Exhale, release right ear to your mat. Bring your arms next to you with the wrist facing up, relax. Soften all the muscles in your body. And inhale back to center. Go ahead on your exhale, interlace all 10 fingers, palms to touch. This time, bound locus. Squeeze your palms, elevate your chest, point your toes back, squeeze your shoulder blades, lift, lift, lift. Good, keep breathing. One more inhale. Exhale, release your grip. Bring your left ear to your back, relax.
Good. Bend your elbows, hands underneath your shoulders. Inhale back to center. Exhale, downward facing dog. Get there any way you'd like, tabletop or high plank pose. Release your knees, have a seat on the center of your butt. And slowly lower all the way down one last time. Hug knees into chest, open up your inner thighs for happy baby with your feet flexed. Capture the inside or outside edges of your feet. Option to rock side to side. Ninja kick or hold stationary without moving. And hug your knees back into your chest. Release both feet on your mat. Lengthen your arms next to you. Shimmy your shoulders together. Feet hip width distance. Inhale, bridge pose. Lift and drive the pelvis away from your mat. Soften glutes. Option for a grip or a bind at your fingers and your palms. Feel that nice stretch from the hip flexors up into the quads. And one more inhale. Exhale, release your spine. And hug your knees into your chest. Release your left leg to your mat. Keep your right knee bent. Capture your shin. Half wind removing on the breath in. Exhale, simple or actually, supine twist to the left. With your left hand on your thigh, use a little bit of pressure to push down and keep your right arm extended. Gaze to the right. Inhale, come back through center. Neutralize your spine. Exhale, release your right leg. Keep your left knee bent, half wind removing. Deep breath in. Exhale, supine twist. Guide your leg across your body. Extend your left arm. Use some pressure to push down. Intensify that stretch from the IT band into the mid spine. Inhale, hug your knees into your chest. And your exhale, squeeze into a teeny, teeny, tiny ball. Now take one inhale. Exhale, release into Shavasana, final resting pose. With your eyes closed, your arms and legs extended. <sighs> Completely soften your facial muscles, your jaw, your eyelids, and surrender as you release into this meditative state, restoring your mind, your body. And open just to receive the present moment, staying in this present moment. You can stay in Shavasana, or if you'd rather move on, begin to invite movements into your body, your fingers, your hands, bigger joints to your elbows, your knees, ankles, 
With your eyes closed, take anything else you need, wall-to-wall -wall stretch, fetal pose. If you took fetal pose, gently press up into your comfortable seated position. If you're still on your spine, knees into chest, rock and roll, gain momentum so you can sit up straight. Bring your hands together at heart center. Lift your thumbs to the crowns of your head. Thank you so much for taking the time to commit to your practice, allowing me to be your guide through your journey. I bow to all of you. Namaste.